Welcome to this video tutorial on how to create a custom slideshow in Corel Video Studio Pro X5. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a quick and simple photo slideshow using this application. Before we start the project, we need to adjust some settings in the settings menu. Go to settings menu and select preferences or press F6 key on your keyboard to launch the preferences. In the Edit tab, set the desired value for default inserted image color clip duration. The default duration is 3 seconds, but for this tutorial, let us extend the duration of each image to 8 seconds. Set the value of default transition effect duration to 2 seconds. Check the automatically add transition effect to enable this option. Select the desired default transition effect. For this tutorial, choose random in the drop down list. Click on OK to apply the changes. Now, we will add the content that you want to see in your slideshow. For this tutorial, we will use the landscape photos. In the media library, click the add button to add a new folder within the library. Name the folder Slideshow. Click on Import Media Files to launch the browser where you can navigate the images that are stored in your hard drive. Select all the images that you want to include in your slideshow. Click on Open. Video Studio creates thumbnails of these images in the folder under the media library. The thumbnails of the clips are automatically highlighted once they have been imported. Hover your mouse on one of the selected images, right-click on it, and choose the Insert to Video Track. The images will be placed onto the video track in the timeline. Click on Pick Project in Timeline window to see all the images on your screen. Video Studio automatically applies the set clip duration and randomized transition effects among the imported images. In the Timeline View panel, highlight all the imported images. To do this, press and hold the Control key on your keyboard and then press A key. Right click on any selected images and select Auto Pan and Zoom. Video Studio automatically applies randomized pan and zoom effect on each image in the timeline. To change the transition effect, switch to Storyboard View and select the transition effect that you want to change. In the Transition Library, select the transition effect that you want to apply. Drag and drop the chosen transition effect on top of the existing effect in the storyboard panel. This will replace the existing transition effect with the one that has been chosen in the transition library. To adjust the applied pan and zoom effect, right click on a clip in the storyboard panel and select open options panel. In the photo tab of the selected clip, click the customize button under the pan and zoom option. This will bring up the pan and zoom window. Manually adjust the pan and zoom effect of the image by changing the parameters on the starting keyframe and or the ending keyframe. In the navigation panel below the previous screen, switch to project mode and preview the entire project. To export your project as DVD slideshow video, proceed on step 3, Share, and choose Create Video File, DVD, DVD Slideshow 16 by 9. Name your project and click on Save to start the rendering process. Once the video has been rendered, you can now play it back on your PC or burn it as DVD video format 
on a DVD video disc using Corel Video Studio Pro X5. Thank you for watching.